Welcome, everyone. Welcome. What a great group of family and friends. I'm all about that. Betsy and I would like to thank everyone for coming and uh, appreciate that. And also like to thank Charlie and Julie for hosting us in the coolest city of Athens, Georgia. We want to thank Stokes and Betsy for William because he is a wonderful, patient, kind, compassionate. What could you offer your daughter more than that? I wish you guys nothing but the best for the future, even though it will be a little tough knowing the Gamecocks are coming back to regain the East in a few years. Woody, you make Callie so happy, and I still see that same giddiness when y'all are together that I first saw when she told me about you at our beach house. I absolutely cannot wait for us to officially become family tomorrow and cannot thank you enough for making Callie so happy. So let's raise a glass to Callie and Woody the fourth. Hey, y'all have a healthy, prosperous, and fruitful life together, and we love you. William Stokes Halk the fourth, not Woody Stokes Halk the fourth, was our firstborn child in Augusta, Georgia, and William was born via C-section and came out with his eyes wide open. It was unusual. I was, I was beautiful. William has done nothing but make Betsy and I proud. I was immediately drawn to Callie's calmness and laid back personality. I was watching William watch Callie and once again those eyes were wide open. And he had this beaming look of proudness on his face. A few weeks later they were engaged. Growing up with William was definitely always an adventure. You know, as we grew older and, and matured, I think our relationship grew as well. You know, we're brothers, but we've turned into just good friends also. You know, he's been someone I can look up to and lean on when I need to, and, you know, I really appreciate that as well. You know, when it comes to me and Callie, I say he's making a great decision. Having sisters has been the biggest blessing in my life. Growing up, the younger sister, you know, relies on the older sister and kind of looks up to them for advice and guidance. They want to be just like you. And over the years, that dynamic has completely shifted. Callie, I so admire you. I look up to you. I want to be just like you. At heart, Callie is really a really sweet person. Al, thank you for always being the best sister in the world. You would run to the ends of the earth to make anyone in your life happy. No one deserves happiness more than you do. Woody, you have brought that happiness and light to Callie like I've never seen before. I could not be more excited for you to join our family. Too. How are you doing? Are you ready? Yeah. Love you. Love you too. Are you nervous? <laughs> you yeah, nervous? I'm a little nervous. It looks beautiful. I love it. Incredible. The thing about Callie is that she shows up for you every day, every time, any time that you need her. So Woody, it makes me so beyond happy to think about what this is going to look like for y'all's life. Becoming husband and wife, for your two families becoming one, and eventually for a family of your own. You are the luckiest to have the glue, this Callie, that will hold you all together no matter what life throws your way. You two are truly two of the best people I know and cannot compliment each other more. Woody, we love you so much and love how much you adore our Callie. I'm so thankful to have become so close with you and know you're the perfect person for her. So we come together today to publicly mark 
what is already happening between Woody and Callie, to publicly mark that two different people have now become one unit. And so that challenges us all to shift our approach to Woody and Callie. Our approach is now to them as a unit and doing everything in our power to support them through this journey, through whatever twists and turns life brings to them. In the name of God, I, Woody, take you, Callie, to be my wife. I, Callie, take you, Woody, to be my husband. To have and to hold. From this day forward. For better, for worse. For richer, for poor. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Until we are parted by death. This is my solemn vow. This is my solemn vow. Now that Callie and Woody have given themselves to each other by solemn vows, and the joining of hands, and the giving and receiving of a ring, I pronounce that they are husband and wife. Those whom God has joined together, let no one put asunder. I'll present to you Callie and Woody Hauk. Thanks to all of you for being here. I think this is really as much about you as it is about Callie and William. If we put up this big tent and hired the florist and uh, I don't know how many piece band, there were five of us here, it wouldn't be much of a party. So this is really as much about you and you're the support group. You're the, you're the ones who are gonna laugh with them and cry with them and, and hang out with them. And um, that's what it's all about. So we thank you all. We know you've come, a lot of people have come from a long way. We're just super grateful that, that you're here. Mom and Dad, thank you for everything. Mostly for giving the three of us each other and also for the very special place that's filled with a lot of love and memories with a lot left to be made. Callie and Woody. I can't put into words how excited I am for y'all, and I just can't wait for all that we have to look forward to together. Here's to you both to a long, happy, healthy life together, and here's to all of you. Thank you so much for being here. We're grateful. Callie, you're, you're amazing. Keep pushing me. I love you. I see how driven you are. Nothing stops you. I love you. I couldn't ask for a better person to marry. Let's get this party started. Mr. and Mrs. William Howe! Make some noise for me, y'all! Give me the word, I'm there. Uh, nah, 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 hey, okay. We ain't got to hesitate, cause baby, this our chance. Feel my heart accelerate every time I dance. Hear you hyperventilate and got me in a trance. I just gotta have a taste, I wanna dance. Give me a feeling. 